Good morning, Berries. It's the morning. Um, it is, it is like nighttime. It's like nine o'clock. I've been doing gaming videos all day and um, got in yesterday. And when I got off the plane, my back was hurting me really bad. And I thought, I was like, oh, I must have just sat weird or something. And then I, um, I came home and I like rested my back and then I put a heating pad on it and it just kept getting worse and worse and then I like have this app called Soothe and like it's basically an Uber for massage therapists and they'll come to your house and give you a massage. It sounds so bougie I know but it's LA and like all things are possible. I had a massage therapist come over late last night and um, he said that my like muscle and my tendon, my tendon had like left my muscle. It's something weird where um, I, I, I can't even explain it, but it was just like, it's super painful and it just, it just goes back on its own after you like rest it, but it hurts and today has been like a little frustrating because um, I had to cancel a lot of stuff because I have a video that's coming up um, or a shoot that's coming up next week where I have to do a bunch of stunt training for it. And if I'm not better, then I can't do it. I don't know, I just feel like crap. <laughs> My allergies, destroyed me over the weekend and then I started my period which I mean like life for I know you don't want to know that but like let's be real that that is just the worst it's like a week before I'm even supposed to which is like why 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 and now my back's hurting I feel like I'm falling apart I feel like an old person that's falling apart and I can't get it together and it makes me feel weak and makes me feel dumb and it, I feel like I feel like a loser <laughs> And now I'm just feeling sorry for myself, so that's accomplishing a whole heck of a lot. And I'm falling behind on videos because I was traveling and I didn't get stuff done. This is just a busy week. We have Y'all West at the end of this week, which is um, a young adult like book festival. There's going to be a bunch of authors there. And I have a few panels and I'm doing a signing and um, YouTubers are going to be there. So I'm really excited and pumped about that. But there's a lot that I have to do before that. And that's happening in Santa Monica. Oh, look. I think John's here with Chewy. John left to get Chewy. Pick him up for my cousins. Let's see. <gasps> Hello. Hello. Welcome home. Was he happy to see you? Oh, yeah. Chewy. <gasps> oh. Oh. When I got there, Chewy was in the cage. <gasps> like, ready to go. No way. He like, knew it was happening. No <laughs> like, way. In the cage. Like, Leilani opened up the door, like, so that I could see, like, Chewy. And this thing is just in the center of the room. Just and, by itself? And he is just sitting in the middle of it. He's just like, hey, 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 Oh my hey. gosh, and he didn't get out when you got there? Yeah, no, he stayed in. <laughs> oh my gosh, because he wanted to leave. You missed yeah. us, too. And then, and then I was talking to Leilani for a little bit, and then he, like, comes busting out there. And he's like, hey, <laughs> He's like, let's go home. He stayed with my cousin Leilani um, over the weekend. She has another pup. They get along really well. She spoils him, so it's good. The house is so lonely without Chewy. It's so sad. John, I ordered us dinner. You did? Yep. Yay. Like Thank a you. good American Thank woman. You. Thank you, American woman. <laughs> Los Angeles. Los Angeles woman. So I'm making dinner. I just ordered it. Welcome to living off the land. We've got another tip for y'all. Now listen up. Today we're making some crock pot sesame chicken. We've got all the our ingredients set out in front of us here on this countertop. And uh, here we have some cornstarch, a little bit of science, ketchup, soy sauce, red pepper flakes, sesame seed, some onions, some garlic, and y'all chicken breast here. They're gonna go on that pot. Now go ahead and chop y'all onions up. Y'all don't need me for that. <laughs> And that's how it's done. Now let's move on to the garlic. Now when you're cutting up these little critters, they might be inclined to make you cry, and you might be inclined to fight back, but don't, because they're your friend. Now let's put them all in that bowl. Don't worry about making a bit of a mess. It's gonna happen. Nothing you can do about it. I almost forgot about Mr. Bear and his secret honey. We're about to use that. Let's put that in there, half a cup. Now let's turn it up with this soy sauce. One quarter cup, please. Oh, and don't forget that one tablespoon of olive oil. That'll just fit in there nice and snug. Now let's go ahead and squeeze about one eighth cup of ketchup into this concoction. Now let's go ahead and mix this bad boy in with all the rest of our friends. Mmm, yeah. Oh, check it out. Now you just gotta mix it all nice and 
slowly like. Cookman, cook for me. We're getting there. We're getting there. <laughs> and don't forget your red pepper flakes add a little kick to your guns. Mmm. Now let's lay down our late friends in this here crock pot of imagination. Now don't forget to put some salt and pepper on our friends here so we can properly lay them to rest. Now it's time to add our little potion to our friends over here. Mmm. Oh yeah. It is looking mighty fine. Now let's go ahead and cover this bad boy and turn it up to low and we're gonna let that sit for four hours. Sounds about right. And remember kids to keep your cooking space all clean and sanitary because if you don't, who will? Maybe a scarecrow. That'll work. Four hours later. Yeah. Actually, it was like six. Yeah, this oh got over a tiny bit, but oh, look how good it looks. It's completely a different color. I have some like white That's rice. chicken. Oh. Yeah, we have healthier rice, okay. but but it's really late and we're playing SP17 craft and we don't want to, so. Oh my gosh, this looks amazing. Chewie wants some. Chewie, of course Chewie wants some. Chewie's like, give me some of that. Oh my gosh, this looks so good. I can't wait to try it. You ready? I'm gonna try a piece, let's try a piece together. Okay. Okay. Three. Whoa. Oh, it's so good. And it's like beef jerky, it tastes so yummy. Oh, I think that overcooking helped. Chewie. Chewie, eat a little speck. Chewie yeah. likes it too! Eat it with this mm. meat. Mm. This would be good in burritos. Mm. Oh, that's so good. I want it. That's really good. Yeah! Thank you for watching Living Off the Land. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so let's take a break from our little Minecraft adventures. Uh, something came in the mail today. I wonder what it is. I don't know what it is. It's something John gave me this package. It says protect from heat. It says it's from Etsy. <laughs> It smells really good. Is it a candle or? Wait. <laughs> I feel like I know what this is. I feel like you do too. <laughs> I'm not trying to say anything. I know exactly it. what this is. You got me too. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I can explain myself. She said she's she's been looking for organic deodorant and the only one she's found is the one at Target and that's Tom's. And she said it smells bad. Yeah, and I've tried other ones from like Whole Foods and stuff and they just don't really go too well with my body. So, um, and then I was using a crystal and that, that works really good. But, um, yeah, I don't want to like use any like other bad deodorants anymore. I want to use no, stuff that doesn't have the chemicals. Not bad stuff. I'm seriously, I'm not like trying to say it. Like, no, no. You need to like put something out. No, I've been I'm complaining. How many times yeah. have I complained about the deodorant? That's why. You hear? You hear? Yeah, I've, I've <laughs> said it like quite a few times. I'm like, dang, I need to find new deodorant because I haven't been wearing deodorant. And it just feels like, it feels gross. I mean, I don't like smell like BO or anything. It just is not like, I don't know. I want to neutralize. You know what I mean? Thanks, John. This is so sweet of you. <laughs> Welcome. I knew exactly what it was when the, after I sent I was like, wait, this is deodorant. He got me deodorant from Etsy. <laughs> <laughs> it's hilarious. 